moment and couple in three dimension in two dimension analysis it is often convenient to determine a moment magnitude by a scalar multiplication using the moments arm rule in three dimension however three dimension however the determination of the perpendicular distance determination of the perpendicular distance between a point or line and the line of action of the force can be tedious computation and the line of action of the force can be tedious computation a vector approach with cross product multiplication then we can the advantages with cross product multiplication reason the moment in three dimension we should start with this topic moment in three dimension consider a force f with a given line of action acting on body body as this as shown in this picture force F and the line of action of F and any point O not on this line point O establish a plane A this plane which show it shown with the dashed line The moment M O of F about an axis through O normal to the plane. This is normal to the plane. As this the magnitude of M O equals to F T. T is the perpendicular distance. from line action to 
Here the independent of O is moment is also referred to as the moment of F about the point O. The vector M O is normal to the plane and is directed along the axis through O. We can describe both the magnitude and the direction of M O by the vector cross product relation introduced in the previous chapter. The vector R runs from O to any point R from O to any point in the force line action So the momentum can be calculated in the cross product has this relation. The correct direction and sense of the moment are established by the right hand side described previously. Thus with R and F here. F and R. This as force vector emanating from O. The thumb point in the direction of MO is the finger of the right hand side chair in the direction of rotation from R to F through the angle alpha. Therefore, we may write the moment of F about the Earth's axis as this relation. The order R plus F of the vector must be maintained because F multiplied to R would produce a vector with a sense opposite to so the term R multi cross section to F must be made evaluating the cross product it's the next page we have to evaluating the cross product M O if F consists of the three component and R consists of also three component so we can write M with the determination of this matrix Rx which has three products R Y F Z minus R Z F Y R Z F X minus R X F Z and R X F Y minus R Y F X the R J I J K direction. This grass product can be shown in this picture. 
for i direction we choose first i and eliminate this column and row and calculate the its determination and for j we eliminate this row and calculate the determination with minus sign and for k we also do the same process the next section is the moment about an average value axis 